so I have a doctor's appointment this morning uh, with the ortho to check out my right knee. And so I thought before going in, I've just, you know, really been thinking about me and my family and the position we're in and the nomadic journey and nomadicism, as we're saying, uh, the normalcy we're giving it, how um, just a few days ago, right? We were literally in our cars, in a park, figuring out monies and funds. And here's the thing, for anybody who's trying to figure this thing out or trying to understand, you know, where they fit in or um, the confusion between supporting because you're donating and you're helping a bigger cause and feeling as if you're taking care of someone, right? The other night we were sitting in the park and we were just trying to figure out between the funds that we had just exhausted, like between the different jobs, the different events that we, you know, take on. And so those monies that we get and we calculate and we do what we need to do to manage. Um, we were really trying to figure out, okay, where are we going to go tonight? Where, wh what are we going to do? And the kindness of uh, our dear friends, India and Anya, you know, and this is a couple that I met right when I relocated here and they have been good to art and to Brie but I make this video because I started thinking about Christian and and what some people just considered being good people like I'm just a good person right I see someone in need I see what they're doing I see that because here's the thing, this is the thing I was thinking about, because at first I thought to myself, why make a video, why talk about it, why normalize it, why put energy into it, right? Why even focus there? But it made me think, it really made me think. There are people who go to school, and so while they are in school, or while they are doing whatever they're doing, right, to become whatever, um, they have support of people, right? And then there are people who, let's say while they are, um, you know, trying to start their business or their company, and maybe it is something that is a little more favorable, right? So people understand it and they get it and they can get behind it. And so they show their support there. In our case, and I started thinking about it, I said, okay, how do you show people your progress, Nakia, when you are an author, when you write, when a lot of what you do is more so um, as you do it type of thing. And then there's a, an accomplishment done and an award or whatever, you, you know. And then I say, how do Brie and Art show people progress and progression through what they do, through uh, their company, right? I started thinking that, you know, so that the support feels genuine and it really feels like I'm helping you get to a common goal and not I'm taking care of you. Like I'm taking care of grown people. Because when... We went to our friend's house, and although it was just an overnight stay, I really did. I got to think, because I even said to myself, I said, I said, Kia, are you a person that helps in your lack or when you don't have, or you're a person that sees past what's going on, or you're a person that really just says, I am going to help because I can, and so I'm not looking at my situation. Are you a person that you put it on being a Christian, being a person that, you know, I've gone to church, I go to church, or are you just looking at it from a humanist, like human, just being a human, just being a human being, just being a person that says, um, I just want to do good. I just want to be a good person because I've had this, I don't know, I, I don't even want to say a weight, but I've had like this, this, I've been, I've been just having some questions lately. I, let me say that I've been having questions lately, you know, regarding Christian and Christ like and what that is and what that looks like and how there have been. Uh, and I keep a, I, I do. I keep a tally of people who have helped. I do. I keep a tally of those people who have helped and what they've done, because not all of it is finances or financial. But I do that for me because I know growing up Christian and growing up with scripture and stuff about owing no man and being able to pay your debt, right? And being able to give back. Because I also know that's a lot of the reason why a lot of people haven't helped or don't help, especially me and my family. It comes down to, and it boils down to, I've helped before, I've given, 
right? It comes down to you owe me because of something I've done. And then it also comes down to people honestly saying, and I don't have to. But I've been sitting and I've been thinking about that. Like I've, I've literally have been sitting and thinking, am I saying that I'm a Christian because of what I do? Or am I, just, am I being a good person because, you know, God, the person I believe in, the, 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 the um, spiritual being, just requires me to love and to be there for another person and to help, right? And then I asked myself and I kept asking myself and I have been saying this. What does that look like for me to do that outside of my situation and outside of my circumstance? What does that look like to do that constantly, like on a continuum basis? Not just because I feel like it today or not just because um, it felt good yesterday or not because, and, I, and I, I've been thinking about this, giving and helping because I know it can be returned, Right? There have been times I've been in that space, a situation of, am I really helping if I know the person I'm helping can give it back, can return it? Uh, and I'm telling you, I have been blessed tremendously to see things differently, right? Just in the human form, just like outside of me being inside of a church building where I used to run and go and worship and then, you know, they say leave and you, you're really serving, you know? And I started thinking, but am I serving when I leave? Am I really doing that? Or was I putting it under Christian Christ? Like, I'm a Christian, you know? Or was I being just a good person? You know, because I have known people to say and feel as if I'm just a good person. And they don't even want the weight of saying Christian because that carries a lot. I feel like that carries a lot. And I've told numerous people before, I don't even lead with that anymore. Because on the front of that is Christ. And if I am a believer to know what I say he's done, how forgiving and loving and caring. You know, people always want to go to what fits them, what feels good to them. Like, well, no, honey, you can't keep getting over on me and doing me wrong because I ain't stupid and I know God gave me common sense and I know when to cut it and be done. Wow. I don't know. I've been thinking about that a whole freaking lot. Does it make me a good Christian or a good person? When I'm able to give, when I'm able to see the need, when I'm able to help, right? Am I more Christ-like, you know? Or am I just being a loving, kind, considerate individual? Or are they one and the same? I don't know. It's interesting, though, um, what I have learned and what I'm learning about myself, about my circles, my people that I call my friends and family, about how it looks to have had some conversations with some people like and I, 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 I don't wow y'all all I can <laughs> all I can say is it's it's really it's really helping me I am not going I won't even shuck and jive and shoot you no bull it's helping me I'm, that's all I'm going to say. I didn't even intend. I did not intend for it to even go this long to say this much. Because in all honesty, I thought it was just going to be a question. And then just a thought or something, right? But I don't know. I, I'm, 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 I'm interested to know. Because I know for the most part, those people. And when I look at the names of the people who I keep a running tab of. Like, I honestly say, God, and you know. And when I put my hand on it, because I say there's going to come a point in time that even whatever they gave is not going to even amount to the things that I give in return. That's why I'm not calling no names. That's why I'm not looking at the list. Because those who have given out of their heart and out of the kindness and out of the consideration of knowing, hey, I'm not taking care of these people, but I'm just being a nice or a good person or... A kind person or maybe I'm doing my civic duty as a human being as a sister you know uh, that has met this sister as a brother who is close and I know this family and I see what they're doing I don't know I, I'm telling you to have those conversations and to be in different spaces and to have an eye-opening kind of moment that says wow was was I doing it though under Christ and Christian 
So there's this point or this tick or this there's a one more good thing that I did or or I did for somebody. I don't know. But anyway, I just wanted to share that thought. I wanted to I wanted to ask that question cuz I'm I'm curious. I'm I'm interested in knowing. But I'm getting ready to go into my doctor's appointment and uh I'll talk to you guys later. Kia M out.